What is the most OP build for Shamir in Fire Emblem Three Hopes? Shamir is finally here. She's actually stronger than I initially thought she would be. Her unique is really fun to play around with too. It's like Monica, but better. And just like Monica, Shamir's best class is gonna be Dancer. But not just any Dancer. I present to you Frozen Walker Shamir. We have two weapons of choice today and the choice is yours. The first of which is a sword with chain and boost consecutive hits, three on it. The second is a sword with boost regular attacks and boost consecutive hits. Ultimately, you're choosing between consistency and skill. The first sword is easier to max out your damage. The second has higher potential, but is much harder to reach. Our accessory is going to be pretty simple. We're going with a crit ring. Nothing too special here. Our battalion is going to be resist cavalry, but the choice is yours. This is not mandatory. As for our arts and spells, we're running Blizzard and Ice Blade. Blizzard is a magical ice spell that helps us freeze enemies into place, and Ice Blade does much of the same thing. It's just the sword version. Both are very powerful freezing spells. As for our uniques, Cold Calculation is the reason we're running Dancer. If we strike with the right timing, our critical hit rate is greatly increased. And if that wasn't enough, our attacks will also be imbued with ice. This gives another option for freezing enemies. Survival Instinct greatly restores the warrior gauge when an enemy commander is defeated. Deadly Aim increases damage dealt by 50% when ordered to attack. Tome Buster gives us a 95% damage boost against tome wielding enemies. And now we're on to the core abilities. As per usual, watch till the end to see where I got each one. Sword Prowess boosts our damage by 30% while wielding a sword. Darting Blow increases the amount that successful attacks fill our Awakening Gauge. Boost Critical gives us a critical hit chance boost. Essence of Ice transforms our Ice Elemental, Combat Arts, Spells, Strong Attacks, and Class Actions into more powerful versions. Patience gives our attacks a large damage increase to stun gauges while the enemy is readying an attack. Gather gives the first hit of our combo the ability to pull enemies in front of us. Special Dance not only boosts the damage of our Dance class action, but it also increases how long that class action buff lasts. This is a very important element of the build. Soul gives us health recovery based on our luck with each defeated commander. Serene Stance prevents bows and tomes from knocking us back mid-attack, and Stalwart Dance does the exact same thing but for swords, lances, axes, and gauntlets. This makes it so enemies can't hit us out of our dance, assuming they're not already frozen. As for our stats, you're going to want to build Shamir with high magic. Mine is not quite as high as I would like, and as such, my damage isn't as high as it could be. I think 120 levels in Mortal Savon is the ideal path for this build, giving you both high strength and high magic, with a small boost to your luck for soul activation. Speed and dex are important too, but much less so than strength and magic. As for the combat loop, this time, it's very simple. You use Blizzard and Ice Blade to freeze your enemies in place and follow that up with a full dance class action combo. This boosts your movement and attack speed by a large amount. Use this buff to start activating fast versions of Cold Calculation, our character unique. This will really open up your damage as well as your ability to maintain your ice. Freeze enemies as they unthaw and just keep increasing your combo to boost your damage. As for where I got each ability, Sword Prowess is from Myrmidon, Thief, and Mercenary. Darting Blow from Pegasus Knight. Boost Critical from Sniper. Essence of Ice from Warlock. Patience and Gather from Trickster. Special Dance from Dancer. Soul from Falcon Knight. Serene Stance from Mortal Savon. Stalwart Stance from Great Knight. Blizzard should be a naturally learned spell, and Ice Blade is learned from Thief. If you like today's build, don't forget to drop a like and subscribe for more.